Okay, welcome back, friends. We're here again today with Ali. Say hi, Ali. Come on in. Hey, guys. <laughs> okay, so, so today, today we're going to do an EMG workout, an electromyograph workout. So all these other influencers you see out there that they're doing these workouts by science. So basically what it is, they hook up little devices to pick up the electrical signals in your muscles to see which ones are working, basically, and what's more efficient. So we're going to do one of these efficient workouts. Uh, it's going to take us about an hour to do, so just... Follow along. So this is a workout by science. Um, a number of influencers are doing this now. So we're not investing 15 grand in the machine to do it. We're just doing it following their cue. <laughs> so, so that's it. I think for guys, especially guys over 40 like us, uh, it, it's the perfect situation because it allows you to do a workout being more efficient. You know, so we don't have to do you know giant sets and hundreds of different sets and sure. and you know hours and hours of volume. It gets down to the point. It gets it done, and we're out of the gym. All right, so uh, follow along, and uh, here we go. Perfect. Okay, guys, so I thought I'd do a little voiceover here just to explain exactly how this works and how we're doing this. Uh, this is the perfect workout for guys over 40, 50, 60, 70, whatever, simply because it's easy on your joints. Typically, I can do a set of 10 with 110s, uh, get, a, get a nice full range of motion. But, you know, the next day, my shoulders are feeling it, okay? Especially my interior uh, delts are really feeling it, my front delts. So, this sort of alleviates that problem while allowing for growth. Now, the EMG data shows that this is all you need, the best, best way to, uh, to attack the chest, isolate the chest is you're gonna put your, squeeze your shoulder blades together and use a weight, you know, half of, typically half of what you usually use. So like I said, I usually, I can do 110s for 10. So here I'm using 55s. So what I'm doing here is called the cluster set. So I'm doing that 15 and then I'm doing four sets of five right after the 15 with 10 seconds rest between each five. So this will really, really, you know, isolate your chest. Um, you can really get a good mind-muscle connection through this. So I suggest you give this a shot because it's, it's amazing. It really does feel good and you get such a nice pump out of this at the same time. Okay, so that's what we're doing. We're doing three sets of 15 and then 5, 5, 5 and 5 with a 10 second rest between each set. If you need to push it to 15 seconds, then push it to 15 seconds. At least work your way to 10 seconds and uh, you're gonna feel it. Okay, so you can see Ali doing his here. He's using a little less weight too because he's got some shoulder issues. So, you know, this will help. If you have shoulder issues, by all means, give this a shot because uh, this is, as far as EMG data is concerned, uh, this is the best way to do your chest. Just squeeze your shoulder blades together, pop your chest out, and push up. And you're really going to feel the isolation, and your pecs are going to thank you later, especially when you're at the beach. <laughs> All right, so give this a shot, guys. No rest. No, no. I've been down so long that my mind can't get no rest. No, no. This ain't easy, darling. Cause the devil was on my trail. I've been running. Don't worry. 
Okay guys, so uh, you can see here, we're doing the same thing, except my bench this time is at 15 degree angle, so it's up just slightly. EMG's data says that uh, that's all you need is 15 to 30 degrees. You don't need to go high on the incline in order for it to hit your upper chest. All right, so this has been tested, this has been proven. So, you know, you just need 15 degrees, that's all you need. And so, uh, you know, anything beyond 30 degrees, there's too much anterior delt involved in here. So, uh, the lower it is, even though it's on a slight incline, the better, as far as your upper chest goes. So, the notion that you need 45 degrees, etc., is just false. The EMG data does not support that hypothesis. All right, so this is a good way to do it. So again, we're doing 15 to start. We're doing three sets. And then we're doing five, 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 and five in our cluster set again. All right, so you would do this right after the flat bench. So now, so you've hit, you know, the middle pec, uh, the bottom pec, and now we're going for the upper chest, the upper pec. All right, so this is the way to do this, guys. Um, this this will kick oh, your ass. Fuck. Yeah. Four, five, six. Come on, get that range of motion, Ali. Come on. Nine. Big exhales. You're pushing. Come on. Yeah. 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 Fifteen degree incline. Okay, so here we go. We're going to do two sets of dips. Uh, we're going to try to get at least 10 in per set, but do as many as you can, essentially, because this is going to stretch it out. I know this is real tough after those cluster sets because your chest is going to be smoked at this point. So um, try to get as many in as you can in the two sets. And, uh, you know, so give this a shot. This gives you a nice stretch all the way back. Just opens up your pecs, nice. and uh, it's nice. It feels good after you're done. Doesn't feel good while you're doing it. Okay, guys, on to the next exercise. Uh, we're going to be doing machine flies with an isometric hold on one side. As you can see uh, by the video here, I'm holding one side to the center line and just doing my reps with the opposite side. So the first set you're going to do is 15 to 20 as a warm-up. 
and then you're going to do three sets total the other two sets you're going to go as heavy as you possibly can for 10 reps all right so let's give this a shot guys Fuck them all, but you got to. Oh, what the fuck? What happened? Was there a girl on here before? <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> okay, let's go. Uh, <sighs> Nice stretch on the shoulders. I feel like my shoulders are stretched back. Eight. We didn't do nine, too heavy, you know. Ten. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Ah. Nice. Okay guys, let's add a little bonus here. So we're gonna start off with just some triceps. We're gonna do a few exercises, including supersets for triceps. So we're gonna start off here with internal rotation extensions. As you can see, uh, I'm sideways to uh, the cable, and then I'm extending it like I'm pointing towards the ceiling. Okay, so this gets the long head of your tricep. Uh, this feels good, so give this a shot. Start off with this, and then we're going to go into our supersets. Nine. One, two, three, four. Fifteen. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nice. Ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Good. One, two, this will be three, best side. four, five, six, back one. seven, yeah. eight, nine, ten, 
11, 12, 13, 14. Ah. Good. Okay. All right, <laughs> super sets. Push downs. Eight, nine, ten. And overheads. 11, 12. 15, 15. Oh! 13, 14. 15, and 15 over here. Yeah. Ah. All the way down. Come on, stretch it. Eight. Stretch those triceps. Nine. Ten. Eleven. Ten. Nice. Ah, make them work. Damn it. Okay, my friends, we're almost done here with our triceps. So uh, we're gonna fix this with a, another superset. So we're only gonna do two of these. So uh, close grip bench press with dips. You can either do dips uh, on a dip machine, like some gyms have, or you can do it on a bench if you like, but you can add some weight between your legs if you like. All right, so that's about it for these exercises and uh, Suggest you give this workout a shot because it's definitely effective. There we go. Come on, pump it up. Try to get 10. That's it. Two, three, nice. Four, five, six, seven, Eight. Ah, shit. Two more, two more. Nine. That's it. Ah. Good job, failure, that's good. Ah. What we want. Super set, try to get to 10. Try to stay as upright as possible. No, up, up, up higher, yeah. yeah. Make it work those tries. Four. Yeah, look at those tries pumping. Ah. Nice, Ellie. Hey, two more. Go. Come on. Ah, fuck. Big guns. Big guns, Ali. Big guns. Okay. All right, guys. Thanks for joining uh, Ali and myself in this uh, EMG workout. It was fun. It was fast, and it was stressing. So now we're both tired. Time for a shower, and we'll catch you on the next video. Boom.